Hey everybody, CK Transport, uh, here to talk about orientation day two, Crete Carrier Corporation in Lenore City, Tennessee. Uh, pretty good day today. Uh, it was a little bit longer, not too much longer, uh, about an hour longer than yesterday. We got back to the hotel room about 3.30 today. Um, today was uh, basically covering everything about the company, the operational aspect of the company. Um, did a lot of, uh, had a couple tests, um, but they were like open book. Um, you know, we went over the, the answers afterwards. Um, basically stuff like on safety, um, Qualcomm messages, the, uh, the macros, um, just kind of give you an idea. It's basically to help you get to understand how their macros work. A um, little different than what I've dealt with before in the Qualcomm. Um, let's see here, what all did we go over? We went over quite a few things today. Uh, again, it was a lot of operational stuff. Um, we got our driver's handbook today. We got our operations manual today. Uh, we got a couple uh, little goodies too. Got a, you know, the traditional welcome to our company here's a ball cap uh but their their ball caps are pretty nice um we have uh there's five people in my orientation class started out with six yesterday but we're down to five today uh one actually i believe got sent home yesterday don't know why um she was just told to grab her things and come talk to the, one of the admin people and that was last we saw of her um don't know so now we're down to five uh, out of the five, there's four Crete and one Schaefer. Um, Schaefer is the refrigerated side. Uh, let's see here. And I noticed yesterday as I watched, rewatched the video, I did, I say, um, a lot. So I'm going to work on that. I'm new to making videos, so I'll work on that. But yeah, uh, <laughs> A lot of stuff, a lot of stuff, a lot of operational stuff. Uh, it was a good day, a lot of, very informative. Uh, covered um, breakdown, maintenance. Um, we had to sign some more paperwork today uh, for our lock set, our kingpin lock, our uh, the air valve locks, the cuff locks, um, and the trailer lock the lock that goes on the back of the trailer. Uh, you got to choose whether you want a new set or a used set, and they're gonna do payroll deduction on that. Um, Thirty I think it was like $35 cheaper for the used set, so I just went for the used set. Like, whatever. Um, <clears throat> then, so, and then what else did we do? Um, one over how to handle the reefer unit on a refrigerator trailer because i believe that there's going to be some time at some point in times you know crete trucks i've seen crete trucks pull the reefer trailers before i guess when they need help or whatever the case may be because i've also seen schaefer trucks pull crete trailers i guess whenever reefer loads are, are slow or whatever but the the Schaefer trucks or which other is is the reefer division our blue trucks Crete is red I'm sure you guys all know this so yeah um I picked Chick-fil-a again for lunch for dinner um because I'm not a big fan of seafood got Captain D's lunch today was actually really good uh, we got to choose from like a deli sandwich or, or a hoagie or sub, whatever, whoever calls it, depending on what part of the country you're from, or a hot meal. I chose the hot meal. It had uh, homemade chicken tenders with uh, potato wedges and mac and cheese, and it came with a dinner roll. Man, I was, that stuff was good. Probably going to wind up... Might actually get that again tomorrow, too, if we get the lunch option. Because tomorrow's supposed to be like a half day. And technically, we still haven't been hired yet. Um, I guess they're waiting on the hair follicle results, which should be here tomorrow. 
they're supposed to be here tomorrow. Um, but because they keep on saying once you're hired, you know, you'll get all this and hire in your hire pack, so forth, so on, like our driver code. Uh, so that way we can log in to set up our transflow on our phones. The ESS, the employee self-service on the website, it's also through the Crete app. Um, but you need your driver code to uh, do all this, but you don't get that until you're hired. So, uh, and I also had to fill out a paper, uh, which basically everybody did. They're having a defensive driving course, an annual defensive driving course up in Indianapolis terminal uh, after Thanksgiving. And uh, she said, we need you to sign this so that way you can attend, blah, blah, blah. And then you'll get a copy of this in your hire pack once you're hired. So it's just, I guess, tomorrow, half day. We're still going to go over some stuff tomorrow. Um, like equipment. And we're supposed to get uh, issued, like, I guess, once we get our truck from wherever our trucks are at, uh, we're going to get issued the, the locks and the, the tire chains. And if you want to buy a refrigerator, uh, you have it put in at the terminal where your truck is at or your home terminal. My home terminal is going to be Indianapolis. I thought it was going to be Columbus because I'm doing the Midwest region and I live in the Cincinnati region. Um, so I just assumed, but in reality, Indianapolis and Columbus from Cincinnati is about the same distance so one or the other don't matter so I'm gonna be attached to the Indianapolis terminal don't know where my truck is gonna be because uh, all the truck assignments come from Nebraska um, Lincoln Nebraska the home terminal so no one knows what the tractor assignments are yet until we're in higher status and our tractor might be here in Lenore City, it might not be. So if it's not, then I guess they're gonna hook us up with transportation, uh, another rental car or wherever the case may be, so we can go travel to wherever our truck is to go pick it up. And then I assume we're gonna get uh, a load from wherever that is to route us to the house, through the house, so we can get our stuff from home and get the truck all set up and get ready to run. Pretty excited, you know, good company. Everybody at the company so far that uh, I've met, great. Uh, a lot of the other drivers uh, that were sitting around today in the driver's lounge uh, were pretty cool. Um, you got your typical truck drivers, you know, those guys that, you know, you can tell they're lying because their lips are moving, type drivers. And, you know, you got some other drivers that are, you know, that really give you some good information and, you know, be supportive but yeah day two um just to kind of re recap real quick uh, a lot of the operational stuff um a lot of videos a lot of videos a lot of powerpoint slides and it's all just basic orientation stuff um and and you know with and within that basic orientation stuff pertaining to crete um, benefits was the last thing we went over, uh, the 401, which seems like a good deal. Um, you don't have to wait a year. Uh, you can then start your 401 the first quarter after hire. So being that this is, uh, the beginning of November, the next quarter would be January 1st. So that's when I can sign up for the 401 all that stuff. Profit sharing starts after a year that you've been employed here. Uh, benefits. You have to sign up within the first 30 days of your hire date, which should be tomorrow. And then they kick in how to explain this basically because this month has already started. So it's going to be a full 30 days. So if my hire date is tomorrow, uh, November 3rd, then December 3rd will be my 30 days and then the benefits kick in the following month after the 30 days. So 
the benefits will actually start January 1st. Um, but yeah, Creek Carrier, great, great company so far, uh, just through orientation, uh, just the people that work here. Um, you know, again, good company so far. I'm happy. I'm confident in my decision on coming here. And day by day, we'll see how it goes. Um, so again, that kind of concludes today's day two of orientation. Um, I hope I'm being informative. I know it kind of I kind of focused, didn't focus on a whole lot because it was a, there was a lot of videos, a lot of PowerPoints, but it's all basic, just orientation stuff, operational stuff, safety, Qualcomm, uh, th that typical stuff. So there, there's nothing special or anything like specifically worth mentioning. So it's, that's what it is. But anyway, um, I'm going to jump off of here. This is after 11 minutes. This is actually even longer than the video yesterday. <laughs> oh, and that's another thing real quick, and I'm going to make this video even longer. The hotel here, the Wi-Fi absolutely blows. I, I can't even stream Netflix on my phone, let alone my laptop. Uh, it took me over an, uh, like two hours yesterday to upload that video that I did. Um, and I actually had to walk outside and walk uh, over to Chick-fil-A's where I got the best signal for my network. I have Sprint. So yeah, I had to go over there for the video to upload faster. It was, yeah, so the, the Wi-Fi in, in this hotel sucks. But anyway, after 12 minutes now, um, I will make another video for tomorrow, finishing up tomorrow, and uh, getting hired, tractor assignment, where my tractor is, so forth, so on. Uh, if you like this information that I'm passing out, and if you want to follow along to learn more about Crete as I go through this journey, uh, click like, click subs subscribe, subscribe to my channel. The videos will get better. Uh, I'll get better at making these videos. I'll quit saying, uh, and, um, so much. I'm new at this. I'll, I'll get better, but click like, click subscribe, and we'll go through this journey together. And if so choose, come join me over here. All right. We'll see you tomorrow. Peace.